Hey everybody, it's Shawnee with Five Minutes with Shawnee. We've kind of uh, taken a small, uh, a small time off, uh, a time out right now. Uh, the holiday is upon us, the Jewish holiday. I want to t take a step and say, everyone, happy holidays and happy New Year. Whether you're Jewish or not, it's a holiday for everybody. It's a time and place in our lives where, where we come together as a family and really just kind of share stories and just be together. I mean, it's quite you know rare for all of us to come together on that level, but. You know, a couple of things I wanted to share with you. This last week, I um, I was in Temple, and and um, the rabbi was so profound because he said, you know, he was teaching my kids in the community. If we all come together and service others, we're going to get so much back in return. And today, with everything just happening with Mexico City just having the earthquake and Irma and, and all these other... You know, hurricanes and Harvey, you know, what can we do to get back? You know, we're often so caught up in just the everyday activities, make money, make money, do for us, do for me, me, me. But this time in our life, it's really about how can we, you know, how can we service others? And I wanted to read a couple of quotes. One's from Muhammad Ali. This one says, to service others is the rent you pay your room to be on earth, on planet earth. And that's really cool. And the other one is, the best way to define yourself is to lose yourself in the service of others. And that's by Gandhi. So let me repeat that. The best way to find yourself is to lose yourself in the service of others. How, how profound is that? I mean, I always travel in my car with, uh, with protein bars, extra ones, and my daughter Shiloh's, you know, in the back seat, and, and I'll pull up to a stoplight, and there'll be a homeless person just, you know, s you know, standing outside asking for money with a sign, and I always uh, reach in my glove box and give them a protein bar, and, and, and my daughter's like, Daddy, you give away all, the, all these protein bars, doesn't it cost you money? I said, there's no price on to have to give someone food and give someone a meal. I mean, that's priceless in that sense. And she's learned from me. And today's just all about, you know, it's game day. It's called football day today. But really just about what can we do to give back? What can we do to really make a difference? And the rabbi in temple was just so profound. It doesn't matter if it's a rabbi, if it's a priest, if it's a teacher, if it's whatever it is. Just take these bits of inspiration, let's be more for others. You know, so many people in this world are starving, need clothes, need shelter, and need food. What can we do to give back to all those people? It doesn't matter, you know, how we can, no one's gonna remember you for, you know, when, when you pass away with all the money you may have or then all the materials you have in this world. It's gonna remember you with what you've done to give back. That's why I'm on my mission to help so many people, you know, I, I wanna help over 100 people a year walk again. That's priceless to me. These people are stuck in their chairs, the couches, the beds, wheelchairs. They're just surviving. And my whole thing is to go, is to go out there and help them to rehabilitate, to get their brain working in so they can walk and they can uh, drive and get back to work. That's my whole mission. And, and, and my mission is, my, my, might be different than yours, and which is fine. But take a step back and go, wait a second here. What can I do? I don't care if you go adopt a dog account, you know, or, or just go give a homeless man or woman, you know, some water or just some food or, 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 or pay for a night of shelter. I'm not asking for everyone to go out there and jump around right now and, and make the world a better place. But if you can do one good deed a day, that is so huge. I mean, and just, I think, you know, with, with our times and our lives right now, I think it's just, it's just, um, it's got to happen or, or, or we, we should choose this to happen. And that's just my message. You know, Muhammad Ali, um, you know, had a quote, Gandhi had a, a, a quote too. And just be in service of others is so powerful, and especially with everything happening. So I want to take a moment, say thank you. Oh, by the way, my show is on hiatus until about October the first with with other um with with other people because uh, Facebook decided to change the algorithms and kind of block me from the rest of my groups, which is normal. They do it about twice a year. It's, not, it's nothing wrong. They go back and they weed everything out. So you won't see me as much with, with interviews, but I'm coming back strong. My lineup is sensational. It's crazy. It's exciting. So we will, we, we, we're going to come back here, um, you know, soon here and everyone enjoy your day and fight on because SC is playing uh, Berkeley and hopefully we're victorious. And let's all be, let's all go out there and just make a difference and be warriors. It, you know, it doesn't cost us anything. It, it's, we're, we're, we're in service of others. Thanks uh, all you. Enjoy your Saturday. And, uh, enjoy your Saturday. And this is uh, Five Minutes with Shawnee. Thanks so much. You take care, everybody. I love you. Bye-bye.